was important, uh, the organizing committee put up striking the balance between national security and human rights. Why do you think students need to be involved in this conversation, especially law students, regarding this matter, especially at this time in our country? Uh, when you're talking about striking a balance between national security and human rights, uh, in contemporary Kenya we have had problems and a clash between the opposition or citizens themselves and state operators. And that's where now you have a clash between national security and human rights. To me, legally speaking, I would say they are competing interests amongst each other. As one of my colleagues has noted that even the Attorney General himself conceded to the fact that it is a difficult line or a difficult... Uh, Law students are sparring advocates. They're the ones who have always been looked at you know, to deal with these issues. And uh, it's only prudent that you know, we, teach, we train law students on how to articulate and urge out uh, cases of such nature. When you look at uh, our court system in Kenya, not very many decisions are present. You know, not very many decisions have been arrived at in, in as far as police accountability is concerned. For instance, if you looked at the statistics over the, over the last five years, right, vis-a-vis -vis the number of uh, state prosecutions, you know, there are very few cases. We actually, are, actually, on, as of now, we have about three cases that are, uh, where we have police uh, police officers, in which police officers have successfully been uh, prosecuted by the state. Yes. We are aware of how the state is run, um, how this country is governed, and what the core issue or the big issues are coming up. Um, with students who are in law schools now, these are going to be the lawyers in the future and we want that the crop of lawyers that do come out in the future can approach cases with a human rights lens and are conscious of the rights of people. Um, because you find that, uh, you know, a lot of legal institutions have started to set up legal aid, but that's not enough. What you want is an entire generation of lawyers who are very conscious and put the rights of citizens at the centre and, uh, and have spaces to be comfortable enough to debate these ideas and to propose solutions.